Okay, so on my way to the completionist cave, uh, first thing I decided to do was go unlock Bones to Peaches, and after many gruesome hours, uh, I got the points for it. This was, you know, some of it was kind of fun, but uh, the graveyard one and the alchemist one were the worst. I have to say, the tele the teleconnect one was kind of entertaining because it was like a puzzle. Um, and in Shaman one, there's a way to do it really fast, so that one wasn't too bad. But anyway, I did it. Let's go ahead and unlock this. Guardian teaches you how to use the Bones to Peaches spell. Woot, 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 woot. Alright, so I should be unlocking Claws of Guthix here in a second. I know it's kind of newbie that I haven't gotten all these spells, but I just never did it, so whatever. But I, I, I have a Serum in one, but I never did uh, Zamorak or Guthix, so. Doing Guthix, this should be it. Yep. You can now okay, cause a Guthix outside of the room. Okay, I'm now about to uh, unlock the other spell. Do it the uh, Flames of Samurai. Free work cast. Ugh. I'm glad I didn't run into any PKers or anything. That would have been annoying. Ooh. Could now cast Flames of Zamorak outside the arena. Recording. Okay, I just finished the sagas. So let's click here and get my unabridged rewards. Let's see. I screwed up the first time and ate some hind crabs, but it's all good now. It's all good now. Got my book. Let's see what this gives me. Either attack, range, or magic. I will go to range. 3.7k range experience. So yeah. Alright, so I just finished an elite clue from Lake Wars and uh, this is what I got. Cat staff, that's weird. I don't know. Uh, oh, I just did that thing in the desert. Probably wasted a bunch of the charges on my thing. But let's uh, price check the loot. Let's see how it was. So let's see, we've got Rune Play Putty, Nine Restores, Nine Pair Potions, Snapdragon Seed, and a Cat Staff. So 240k. Eh. It's something. <laughs> hey guys, I uh, was just doing some Vegas and I got. Sorry, it's merely. I got, uh, I put them on, I got really lucky, and I got uh, Ragefire Boots, which I am super happy about. I mean, it's 10 mil right there, which is awesome. I know I could have got a better bootstrap, but I've had Glavens before, and, you know, 10 mil is still 10 mil. I'm not going to complain, so. I'm just uh, super happy about that. Just wanted to throw that in here. And uh, see you in the next clip. Hello, so this is going to be the uh, the last clip of this video. I just wanted to say a few things. Uh, one, I'm just going to continue with my progress video series. Uh, I don't have a clever name for going for the comp pips, so I'm just going to keep calling it my progress series. Uh, and plus, like, I put other things in it that are unrelated to the completion escape, such as, you know, random drops I get and stuff like that, so it'll just continue to be my progress here. So I just wanted to end this video, though, with uh, what requirements I left, or what requirements I have for the completion escape. So let's turn on. Okay. So, 120 in the file in Dungeoneering. Uh, I have some quests left. Uh, let's see, I have nine left, so I'll do, do those. But I feel like it. Uh, complete all tasks. I have to do the Martinia ones. Uh, all the Livid Farm stuff. Uh, unlock Person. Uh, Dungeoneering. Uh, full Kudos. I'm 10 Kudos away from that, so I'll do that at some point. Uh, some more music. Um, some random stuff that uh, you finish after quests. I have to do the Fight Kellen, which I'm, I'm getting some money for some gear to do the Fight Kellen. I'm kind of. I'm not. Well, I don't have the gear that I want for it, so I'm, I'm working on getting that gear. Uh, and some more quest stuff, so yeah, that's what I have there. Um, the only other thing I wanted to say is uh, I'm going to start 
linking. Uh, I do a kind of like a PVM thing every. It's usually every Friday with my friend uh, Patrick or Security Tim, and uh, I'm going to be making videos uh, from now on that'll li that'll link you to those videos when he uploads them. Now they're not necessarily always uploaded on Friday, but the reason we call it PVM Fridays is because we pretty much every we pretty much do it late like late Friday night. So uh, you can look forward to those. They're a lot of fun. You get to listen to me rage because I suck at PVM, and uh, yeah. <laughs> So I'll see you next week's video.